are annoying, okay? And so we need to distract them. Slide. Okay? So these are um, horrible menaces to science. <laughs> okay? And they are very distracting. And so, or, and so, slide. Okay, we need to distract children for various reasons because they are loud. Because they are very distracting from my work. Um, they are obnoxious. <laughs> And they throw a rock at your head while you're trying to take your AP world exam. So you, it ends early and you get a one when you really should have passed. Okay, slide. Conflict of interest. <laughs> okay, so this brings up the question. We need to um, distract these children so they do not murder my power lines while I'm trying to take an AP exam. <laughs> I wouldn't complain about okay. that. And so, a sub-question to that is... Oh. <laughs> what an okay. answer. This is a good solution. <laughs> now we have a sub-question. What do children like? And being an obnoxious child myself for 17 years, I know that children like... Slide... Buttons! <laughs> yeah! And they also like... Slide... Math! What? Wait. That's <laughs> 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 okay, and so my first attempt was an Arduino calculator, okay, and so that didn't entirely work, and it was totally not because I ran too much current through it and like it broke in my backpack, totally not at all. That's because I learned that children actually do not like math, I am just a strange child. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 uh, and then it Okay, and so we had a counter for the video. Okay. And so this did not work. It decided to have an aneurysm. And so um, that also didn't work. And so I realized that these screens are stupid. And I had to rethink of what children actually like. So slide. We have to rethink this idea. And so consulting myself again, because I don't know, I didn't have anyone else to ask. Uh, I realized that children actually like... But Okay, so that leads me to my design goals. So we need to build a game uh, that children will play and be distracted with so that they actually do not throw a rock at my power lines. And so that was basically what we had to do, and maybe have some kind of input. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so introducing Snake, because uh, sn Snake hasn't been done before, so we actually have Snack. So this is a totally original concept, uh, never before done. So we now have Snack. Okay, and so slide. So what I did, I did this before on a micro bit. And so, two years ago, in the summer of 2020, I coded Snake on a micro bit. So I thought it would be a brilliant idea to just copy and paste my code. Because, you know, I, I'm lazy, and that's what programmers do. <laughs> okay? And so, slide. I learned that this is actually uh, in Python. The micro bit code is on Python, and Arduino is in C. And so you can't just copy and paste the code. And so we have a fun fact of the day with the It's not equal C. And if you guys want a t-shirt, slide. We made t-shirts. It's only at $59.99. Okay, so that was one of our... Uh, that, this is one of our setbacks. But another one is slide. My computer is crashed. <laughs> because I tried to do this at school and it refused to work. Okay, so I had to do all of my coding on my Chromebook and then send it over to a school computer because my school because the school computers, despite being from 2009, are smarter than my computer that was bad for 2004. All right, and so now we can actually begin to build our actual project, which is the snake game. And so slide. And so we have our beautiful um, screen thingy, and we have our little joystick, okay? And it, it, it moves, the snake game. Slide. And so now there's like an actual picture of whatever monstrosity I have created. Um, and then slide. And so now I know you have to be Ethan to understand code, but I'm just <laughs> trying to explain it to you. 
Okay, so over here, so if you have an input, if it goes to the left, it's going to point the head left. I know it's pretty insane. If you do it right, it's going to go right. Up, it's going to go up. Uh, it's, it's pretty complex math, but I, I think some of you guys can understand it. Uh, next is the borders. Because this is a, a completely original concept, we have uh, open borders. And so if you go to the border, it spawns your head at the other side. That's, it's, it's pretty complex. Uh, next, uh, if the snake hits its body, not necessarily its tail, but the rest of its body, then it will kill itself. Because like all snakes do, they hate themselves. <laughs> <laughs> and then if the head overlaps with the apple, then it will eat the apple and extend the length of the snake. A very intricate code. I'm, I'm sorry if you guys can't understand it, but, you know, it's, it's fine. And so, right, this leads us to the, uh, I guess, analysis of the project. Okay, so the strength, it actually works, which is pretty cool. I did not expect my code that was mostly factored in Python to work in C with the light of bit of refactoring. And you can actually move it around with a joystick, okay? Um, so the weaknesses, it's a bit buggy because again, I didn't feel like refactoring it. And so if you move the joystick, it might actually move in the direction you want like 30% of the time. <laughs> um, but hear me out. It's a bug, or it's not a bug, it's a feature. Because, you know, mm. it's. We got to uh, enrage the children. This is going mm. to build character. <laughs> so whenever they play uh, GTA 5 at the age of eight years old, they, they can actually um, rage at that instead of snakes. Okay, and so the opportunity, you know, this is where you guys come in. You can invest in the snack technology so we can sell it to children all around the world. So I'm looking for $1 million for a 0% uh, at, my, at my company. <laughs> All right, and then we have some threats to my system. So if you touch it wrong, it'll break <laughs> because the wires are really stupid. So if you touch it wrong with your hands or accidentally kick it when you're trying to pick it up this morning, uh, it will not work. <laughs> so, um, and then that leads us to the final slide. My sources so I don't get kicked out of school for plagiarism tonight. <laughs> Okay, so it's it's red. That's yeah. good, right? So it's, it's gotta like. Okay, no. Okay. Oh, why do you raise mm. things off, oh, snake? Okay. Why does it say? Why does it actually spell right. snake instead of snack? It works. Oh, it works. But this it's is enraging, the, this is so I guess it works. Hey, I got an apple. Oh, oh fantastic. All right, all right, well, I think I've got the, uh... You want to see? You want to see? Anyone else want to try? There you go. Oh, my God. Kids are on the road. Oh, the kids. Look at the kids aren't throwing rocks. Yeah, no rocks. Oh, This is why Abe is a Abe pro game. Yo, he hit it. He did turn right yeah. four times. <laughs> <laughs> Try a different oh. direction. No, that's not right. That's what? up and down. You go right. You go right. Oh, I have it turned. Oh, oh well, that oh. would make more sense. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, so I need to hold it this yeah. way. Okay. Is this some innovative? Wait, now it's still. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Well, that works like two percent of the time. <laughs> there we go. This is pretty unreal. My question is, can this screen run Doom? No, <laughs> no. Oh my gosh, this is this is hard. It's, it's, stupid, it's so fast. Abe's gonna kill himself. What's the score? Oh, oh, oh. Don't touch it. Oh. Oh. oh, it only breaks if you hit. It's perfect. It's still going. It's, still going. it's oh, perfect. it's just an infinite. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. oh, it is still going. How do you actually make this thing? Oh, oh. Fantastic. All right. Thank you. Actually, too.